and welcome to week five of my photo challenge series and it is time for another photo challenge. Uh, today uh, we're gonna work with a category that is one of my favorites and I've been waiting to share this challenge with you and I've already started to sit up here a little bit. Um, before we get into it though, I just want to say thank you again everybody who is participating and sharing your work on Instagram. Remember to use the hashtag Kikos photo challenge when you post over there. Last week's theme was superhero and I had so much fun going through the photos and seeing your beautiful creations. There are truly some really brilliant and creative concepts in there. So go and check out the hashtag on Instagram as well. Now for today's photo challenge, we're gonna continue a little bit along the lines of Monday's video where I showed you some tricks to take cell timer pictures with your phone. So I am going to take this photo today from up above and without a tripod and you can do this totally at your home, at your home, at your house, at your home. Well, I suppose that's pretty much the same thing. Um, but today's theme, what is it Kika? Why don't you tell us? Today's theme is everyday items and more specifically turning everyday items into something not so everyday and taking something that is pretty ordinary and making it extraordinary. I really, really like these type of photos and as you know, I've used a lot of very ordinary items in my photos and transformed them into something a little bit of magical or I like to think so at least and this challenge is really about seeing or looking around your house and where you are and looking at things in a way where you don't use them in the way that they're maybe intended to. So again, taking away expectations and stripping away maybe this pre-learned knowledge and forgetting that we know how to use things and actually seeing the potential in them and how we can use them in a new and sort of whimsical way. So you have to be a little bit of, a little, <laughs> a little bit of crazy for this one or think outside of the box. And I'm gonna do some concepts gonna set up here and yeah I'm just gonna take some everyday items that I happen to have at home right now I'm gonna try to keep it pretty simple and um, and yeah let's go photo challenge number five accepted so out of a piece of cardboard I've just cut out this thing and what I'm gonna do I'm gonna hang it up on my clothing rack with these holes and then I've made this cut out here so that when I hang it up on the clothing rack I can put my phone in here and it's gonna be able to take a photo. And I have made a top-down crane with some cardboard tape and a clothing rack. So easy. Okay, so now I have my setup done. So now I'm gonna gather some of my props and style it up here. I've had this table for many years and unfortunately there's some grease stains over here. Um, so I'm gonna try to cover those up then with my hand or something in the photo. <laughs> the sun came out oh that's so nice all right I'm almost done with my setup but because I'm a big believer in having lots of texture and just interesting materials in my photos I'm gonna sprinkle some of these flowers I think on there and then I'm gonna start taking my photo and just see maybe I have to add or take something away as I go along and just see uh, how the composition looks like I think I'm gonna put my hand in there as well because that's kind of my trademark to have a little bit of human presence um, yeah, but that's it. And let's see, um, I think I'm going to connect my laptop to my phone so I can use my laptop as a field monitor, although I'm not entirely sure that it's actually even necessary because this is a pretty straightforward picture.
There's a bee in my bonnet, hello, hello, a bee in my bonnet, hello. There's a bee in my bonnet, hello, hello, a bee in my bonnet, hello.